That was Brad. The next Brad step. himself. Yeah, Brad was talked like the end of the day. Comes out. Mr. He Pitt himself. Out. This is a true story. Mr. Pitt Set it himself. up right, dude. Okay. You're at Brad okay, Pitt's so house. Working. Worked. You're designing his koi pond. Sitting there sketching away, yeah. thinking what Brad, signed the most handsome man on live. I wasn't telling him what I work at his house. <laughs> is that true? We're yeah. not allowed to talk about no, this at all? Fine. It's, Come on, you it's can't talk tense. about it's it. It's past tense. I'm going to talk about it. Okay. I was like, like, dude, I don't think I know you signed shit about, about photos because you told me you're not allowed. You couldn't you're take photos. photos. You couldn't take photos of the house or him, yeah, obviously. You're not allowed to ask for autographs. You're not allowed to like go up to him. That's reasonable. And. Like a few things, kind of like that, yeah. Are you, so was there a thing in there that you're not supposed to be telling the story right now? Like a stipulation of not even talking about it? I know you're not allowed to tell people where he lives. and you were, Right, uh, we're you not doing that. We don't, I don't want to You weren't that. allowed to tell any people you were working at his house, but I'm not working there anymore, so. While we're, cause, yeah, that makes sense, because while you're working there, yeah. they follow you there. Yeah. But you're not anymore. Yeah, okay, so we're safe. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. If, so, we, so if we need to, we can cut this out. But what? Yeah, so basically... Uh, so yeah, you're at Pitt's house, designing I'm his koi pond. Pitt's you're like house. sketching the fucking no, koi, no, jumping no, no, out of no, water. No, Just no, go with no. this. Okay. Just right, go with this. Right, you're right, sitting right. there sketching the koi. Now, so what So what happened was... Brad comes up to you. They were... His aura? Did you notice his aura or him first? It's Brad Pitt, man. All right, so bro, this is what happened, okay? So we're we're like point we're doing the finishing touches. Doing the acid wash. Pond. I got you. No, before the acid wash. Before the acid wash. wash. We're doing the finishing touches, and uh, all of a sudden Brad Pitt walks out, bro. And Answer the question: Did you see him first, or did you just sense his presence? You felt him, right? Like you, I kind of like felt it was him. Like you were looking this way, yeah. And then you just were like, "There's something." I kind of gotta look him. this way, right? Yeah. And then you I'm look a, back. It wasn't the first time I saw him that day, though. But the first, so all right. But this, the first time I saw him was almost crazier. It wasn't like crazy, but he's super chill, dude. He's like, yeah, why wouldn't you down? Be Brad fucking Pitt, yeah, dude. but he like he almost acts like a regular. He like he knows who he is. He knows. You listen to that Mark Maron podcast? Yeah, yes, yes, about. yes. Is he like that for real? Yeah, bro. Like, he knows. Like, you met him at least. He knows. He's the coolest. He knows man he's fucking tight, and if someone <laughs> meets him, and if someone meets him, they're gonna be stoked. He knows that, bro. So he Absolutely. was, he was That's a good point. super friendly. That's tight. Super friendly. That's what I'm getting at. Like, he was so, cool. so the first time aura. I saw him you was in the morning. Aura. You look over. There's Brad. Okay, so yeah. We'll, we'll go with that. Drink so his coffee he comes his out. No, like, he just Damn. walks out. He's in like jeans and a shirt. He's tatted up. He's got some tattoos. I didn't He's know that. He's got his tight. long hair. Okay. And uh, he comes out and you know Brad Pitt's out there. Even if you weren't looking at him, you know because production slowed down. Like, it visibly other people saw him. slowed down. This is, all the workers started doing this. Yeah. They're yeah, all, yeah. like, so looking at him. That's not shaking at him. It's all like the, the attention, bro. All the, the attention. The it was crazy. Wave, and so... It's crazy. Like, you sign a thing saying you can't go up to him. So I was like, I'm not going to go up to him, but, like... But I got to work over there, so mm-hmm. I'm going to walk over there. I'm going to stay close. I'm going to be as close as I can. I'm not going to, like... Uh, you're the supervisor. Yeah, I'm you're the supervisor. You're designing the pond. The koi needs to go... Yeah. We're yeah, so just... I'm just... He's by the koi pond. I... Literally, they're like part of the waiver is like you can't walk around his house, so I had to stay near the koi pond. You were sketching where the koi was jumping. Yeah. So so stay on okay, okay. with okay. the story. So, You're so, sketching okay. Brad. Brad Pitt. Is near Brad where Pitt the koi walks, was go. Brad Pitt walks out and he's kind of like checking it out, looking at it, and his assistant comes up to him and he's talking to his assistant, and mm-hmm. I'm in ear range, so I could hear what they're saying, right? And I'm just kind of chilling over there and I'm like give me an excuse to come up and talk to him you know like give me an excuse and I was like not trying to because I know it's against the rules but like also like fuck the rules this is fucking Brad Pitt bro yeah, fuck the rules this is your shot yeah and so <clears throat> I'll get fired for that and so yeah for sure <laughs> <laughs> and so, I quit I don't give a fuck and so he's talking to the assistant <laughs> and they're he's asking the assistant a question about what's gonna happen to the koi pond tomorrow i don't exactly remember the question but it seemed like a question for you it seemed like a question for me the, the man in charge no the assistant didn't know and i think fish. one other person one other's uh, other helpers were there yeah and they were like oh, i'm not exactly sure and i heard them and, and you so, just you just made so yourself just, look as important as i just as like possible. i was kind of behind them yeah. like this and so i kind of looped so i was like in their vision a little bit because i'm not gonna yeah. sneak up on brad pitt well they're you know? in the way of the where the yeah. boy she's so going. i kind of move around i kind of pulled up and i was like 
this and this is happening tomorrow. And he looked at me, he's like, Dude, that's what's up. He's you like, you know what's up? His question. Yeah, I answered his Un- question. Uncued. Uncued, I answered that's, his that's question. What's up, and so he that turned, wasn't in the rules. That wasn't in the rules. But like, he's technically, he's answers. technically he's the homeowner. He's my main customer. These other people work for him. He's not the customer. He had Amen. a question. I'd answer for him. Brad's asking questions in earshot, and you have answers. I have the answer. You give answers. I have the answer. Why, why, are, so, why are you even questioning yourself? Exactly. You did the right thing. Exactly. So Brad had a question. Uh, you had an answer. I walk up to him. I Boom. Didn't, I'm just kind of. I didn't walk up to him, but I was like, "This is that." And he looks at me, and he's like, uh, "You like are in charge?" I'm like, "I'm supervisor." And he's I'm like, "All right." McCoy. And he's like, "All right." And so I talk to him for a little bit. He's just kind of asking questions. And uh, koi pond related. Yeah, and then I introduced him to Guillermo, who's like the head of the finishing work for the koi pond. And I was like, this full How fucking answer. stoked was Guillermo? Guillermo stoked. Guillermo knew who he yeah, was. Yeah, he, Guillermo knew who he was. Guillermo was he doesn't fan? get super starstruck, though. Because Guillermo doesn't even fuck. Yeah, about Guillermo doesn't, he doesn't watch fuck. Brad's movies. But he was still cool. He was, he was still, like, cool about it. He knew who Brad was. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Everyone knows who Brad is. That's what I mean, dude. Like, so, uh, so I, that, honestly, dude, that's almost more baller. The fact that Guillermo was like, "Yeah, dude, whatever." Yeah. So up, uh, Pitt? it is. <laughs> so then, yeah, I talked. I talked to him for a little bit. That's what was, the finishing and look like, dude. Like, like and I was just kind of like, "Hey, you got any more questions?" Like, I'm your I man, got you, Connor. Yeah. And so he was like, comedy. Take and care. he was like, he was like, "All right, thanks, bro." He touched you. Block by. Did you look at yeah. your? How did how did you play? I, kinda, I played it cool. I was like I was like fuck this motherfucker just touched me. And I walked off and the whole the I was like texting my brother the whole time. I was how like, did how bro, did my Brad Pitt's house? Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, you texted me that. Yeah, texted and so like, and oh my God, so uh, I was like, shouldn't be doing that. I texted like, my right and I was trying to, but I texted we'll my brother. I was like I'm not gonna I was like I just met Brad Pitt and he touched me. I was like fucking pretty stoked right now. Yeah, I'm very stoked. And then the next the next day. What's up? I was there, and we were, and, he was and we were getting down. Like, we were wrapping up, and he walks out again, and I just, like, literally, I'm just happen to be walking the way he's coming. Right. And I'm just like, all right, well, I'm just gonna walk by him. No, no big deal. And he's like, hey, how's it going, bro? Like, good to see you again. And I was just like, oh, thanks, dude. How you doing? And he's like, good. And just kept walking by, and I was like. Mm, yeah, bro, Brad Pitt remember me. He said, what's up? Like, yeah. <laughs> dude, like, did, how yeah. bad did, did you even go for that? Or yeah, you know, it was bro, just weird. Nah. That, that sounds weird. Like, I wish that, did, you know what nah, I mean? Nah, he didn't go for that, but it was cool. No, I know he didn't, but, like, did you want to? No, did, was there I didn't, anything, I didn't or even you were just attempt. like, oh, shit. I didn't even tell. It was more like, oh, oh shit, shit, he's coming, and I was I'm like. About to walk by Brad Pitt. Yeah, and, like, the rules are going through my head, so I kind of, like. Fuck all that. I was like, I'm going to give him a little room. And he kind of. So Maybe dude, read it a little bit. Uh, like, and it's during COVID. Right? Yeah, and it was during COVID, right. so you had to have your mask yeah. on. Yeah, that was that that's was, the other thing about the rules where like it kind of could sound dickish, but yeah. right now it's like no, it's just yeah. It was during COVID, so I had my mask on. That that yeah. was the Fuck. the biggest upset for me was, was that it? I had the mask on because oh, oh. did he? No, he didn't. It's his house. No one fucking cares. But well, you, some people have, dude. I've been working uh, in, you know, construction too, right, and like yeah. a lot of homeowners will greet me in their mask. Right. They yeah, that's how. It, yeah, same. He wasn't you know, in a mask. He wasn't a in a mask. mask. <laughs> yeah, and, <laughs> and Brett Pistler, anyway, But everybody else mask. had to wear one. Yeah, and I was uh, doing the bandana. Go. Everyone else wore a fucking yeah. mask. Yeah, it was early COVID, you know, and so I yeah, was wearing was the I was wearing the bandana, so you really couldn't see my face. And like Connor Costito, I do I I do spots. It wasn't even that, bro. It's like. I don't. I don't want to sound cocky or anything, but like my whole life, like ever That's since I guy. was little, people have been telling me I look like him. Right, you've and told me. And then the one time I meet him, I'm fucking super grateful for meeting him. Oh, oh, super oh, grateful. You'd think that the he would The one say time That's I funny. meet him, my whole yeah. face but is covered, bro. What the fuck bro. do you think? You think he'd? No, I don't time? think. I don't think he'd say anything. I really don't. Hey, I. You look like me. I don't think. Hey, I, I look think, like well, you super. It. I don't think I look like that much like him. I've told you people. That. People have told me that, and yeah. I'm and I I don't ag- disagree with them. You know, I'm yeah. Why would you? Be like, it's a huge compliment. I'd never be like, fuck oh, no, I don't oh, look thanks. like Brad Pitt. Yeah, yeah I'm like, that. I'm more like, all right. So like, what do you want to do now? <laughs> Where do we go from here? Uh, like, how much do I look like him? Because yeah. Brad Pitt would be closing right now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because no, uh, you know me, dude. I get uh, you look like Seth Rogen. <laughs> So it's like, I don't know what to do so with you that. Know, you know you're fucking. <laughs> sure. Seth, he's, he gets a lot of it. He's just uh, No, because I met him. You know I met yeah, him. Yeah, right. Outside of the, yeah. 
Uh, it was it was actually awkward and embarrassing. Because <laughs> yeah, I have the same thing. I thought, and I didn't have a mask. It was you like, met him at a weed shop, though, right? Yeah, but it was across yeah. from. Uh, we were waiting to go up at the Hollywood Improv, right. and I saw him coming, and I just geeked out. I fanboy. I tried not to fanboy out, but it was like, I did, and uh, it was weird. Yeah, no, it's all good. But again, I thought like, hey, look at me, and be like, ah, yeah, ah, then we'd like fuck off and be like, have a brand yeah. new life together, and. Yeah, no, I do.